I'm with two of my favorite ladies having a little birthday uh, tea party, and we were talking about how being stylish starts with what you eat and how you take care of yourself. So Joyce was giving me some secrets, and then Deborah's going to give us some secrets as well. So Joyce, what were your secrets. health secrets? Well, I'll tell you now. Everyone that I've met, older women, older men, they complain of pain from arthritis. And I'll tell you, even younger people are complaining, and you'll see them at the pool. Some of them are having difficulty walking, and you'll see many of them doing exercise, and uh, they hope it's going to help. Very simple. If you have any information, because basically that is behind this arthritis, how about trying some turmeric? that you can go right into the supermarket, but don't, I hope not too many people will go because you won't leave any for me. <laughs> but you buy the turmeric and uh, it's quite reasonable. And uh, you, I take, um, I would say, a teaspoon a day. You put it in your food and you don't even taste it because it isn't the tastiest thing if you're just going to take that powder. So you mix it a bit and uh, you take it every day. And I can tell you, it will help you enormously no medication, and just go about your business. And no processed food, right? That's your opinion. Yeah, no, no processed food, except, you know, you don't want to be a fanatic, and you don't want to take all the joy out of your life. So if you do eat birthday cake or, or a hamburger or whatever, just take it in with joy and just bless it, because it's not going to kill you. It's just that if you're consciously eating it, that's what counts. And then make a conscious effort to eat as much live food as possible. Um, coconut oil is very good. It's very good for it for the for the uh, for the joints and uh, and the heart and also um, what you were talking about hemp seed. Yes, yes. How important hemp seed is for anti-inflammation. Absolutely, you're right. And uh, Deborah, when I mentioned to you salt is not good for you, you mentioned sea salt. Mm -hmm. What do you think about the sea salt? Will you find that if that's very good? Yes, because you've got all the trace minerals in there, so it's it's very important. And even very fine fleur de sel, uh, which is the high-end sea salt from France, is even good for people with, with heart problems and, and uh, high blood pressure. I see. And what uh, properties doesn't it have, perhaps, that you find in the regular salt? What, what would you find? That well, that's that's all been processed, and it's almost like a chemical. It's just, uh, just a straight chemical with no nutrition in it. And it probably has other negative things in it in, in the processing. And the same with white flour and white sugar. So, we'll be updating everyone on our lifestyle secrets and tips every month. Good idea. I love it.